You put that thing away. If anyone sees it, they'll think it's real, and my son will be arrested for Julian's murder. Don't worry, Ivy. Ethan is not going to pay the price for Julian's untimely death. Teresa will. And aren't we glad the state still carries the death penalty? Take me through it one more time. How are you going to get Teresa to confess to Julian's murder? By showing her the doctor tape. You have to admit, it looks great. I mean, it really looks like Ethan is pulling the trigger on his ex-daddy. But how, how do you know that Teresa loves Ethan enough to take the fall for him? Well, she loved him enough to almost lose her case in court, didn't she? Yes. And she loved him enough to allow us to still live here so he wouldn't move out, right? So she'd do anything for him, and that will be her undoing. Oh. I would have bought your argument before. But now there's a new cold glint in that girl's eyes. Have you seen it? Who could miss it? I'm not sure Teresa loves anyone but Teresa. I mean... I'm not sure she wouldn't put Ethan away just so he couldn't represent me. What, what if you show her the tape and she goes straight to Sam? I don't think I can risk that, Rebecca. No, 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 she is not going to turn Ethan in. She's going to fall right into the trap I set for her, just like that greedy little gutter snipe she is. When are you going to show her the tape? When the timing is right, just be patient. This is a very, very delicate operation. I just, I don't think I can wait very long. Oh, you won't have to wait long at all. Oh, looks interesting. May I have a peek? Oh, Rebecca, what is this? What is nothing that would interest you? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh. oh, A Tale of Two Cities. Oh, this is one of my favorite movies. What a coincidence. Mine, too. Oh, yes. Well, it seems we all have a lot more in common than just Julian. We all share a common taste in classic fiction. Huh. What are you getting at, Rebecca? Well, we're all fighting so hard to be Mrs. Julian Crane. Maybe our fight doesn't have to be so, so down and dirty, so adversarial. You may have a point, Rebecca. Oh, Winnie. Oh, this is, this is it. This is, this is it. When oh. Cartone dies for Lucy. Oh, that is true love. <sighs> Yes, imagine doing that for another person. Oh. Would you ever do that for somebody, Teresa? Oh, oh, sure I would. Oh, my gosh, I would do anything for love. I wish you'd tell me how all of this is supposed to play out. Watch and learn, Ivy. Watch and learn. I must say, I'm surprised, Ethan. What, that I ended up despising the man I was raised to believe was my father? Well, you've just always been such a forgiving person. Yes, but there's a line, Rebecca. And Julian crossed it when he ruined Teresa's life. Huh. Now, that's interesting. I would have thought that Teresa's lies would have, would have killed all your protective feelings. Not at all. I love Teresa with all my heart. I mean, her lies did hurt me, and they even ruined our relationship, but it didn't kill my feelings for her. I wanted to murder Julian for the way he took advantage of Teresa. She went down to Bermuda for me. True, it was a misguided admission, but her motives were honest and pure. Now, that's a matter of opinion. Now, Rebecca, I know Teresa a lot better than you do. 
Now, Julian knew why she was down there, but he didn't give a damn. Now, he, he used her naivety against her and got her so drunk she didn't even know she was marrying him. And worse yet, he took advantage of her state and got her pregnant. As far as I'm concerned, Julian deserved to die. You know, I can see why my daughter fell in love with you so many years ago. You are a genuinely selfless person, Ethan. So did Teresa hear it all? She was hanging on every word. But I still don't understand your strategy. You will. When Teresa confesses to Julian's murder. Looks like our taco queen is about to become a tostada. Now where are you going? Come and see for yourself. shooting Julian. You know what to do with it. Sure do. Oh, give us a moment, please. <sighs> okay, Rebecca, now you have really lost me. Ivy, I told you, patience is its own reward. Now, come on, relax. <sighs> Enjoy the show. Come on. Would you mind getting that, Teresa? Not at all. Hmm. I really must speak to Phyllis about having the mistress of the house answer her own front door. May I help you? I need to see Mrs. Julian Crane. Well, that would be me. What can I do for you? I have something for you, Mrs. Crane. Something I think you should see. Right now. 